he's still got the voice, he's still got the hits, but does he still have the face? Barry Manilow's latest appearance has some Grinches online wondering if the Copacabana hitmaker has gone too far under the knife. The Rockefeller Center Christmas tree is an iconic symbol of the holiday spirit for New York City. Workers erected the first tree in 1931 and first let it shine in a ceremony two years later, a tradition that continues today. On November 29th, the 2023 tree lighting celebration took place to much fanfare, but many viewers focused on something else, singer Barry Manilow. Or more specifically, Manilow's current face compared to his face in his heyday. Manilow joined event host Kelly Clarkson, Cher, the Radio City Rockettes, and other special guests. But his looks, not his singing, sparked most of the conversation online. On X, formerly Twitter, one viewer posted, Barry Manilow can hardly move his face from all the Botox. Another joked, Barry Manilow looks like he is wearing a cheap Barry Manilow mask. Another got very specific. He looks like one of the mice in Cinderella. Sad. Happy birthday! Some ex-users compared him to actor Martin Short impersonating Manilow. One referenced another singer close to his age, writing, Barry Manilow should have called Dolly Parton surgeons. Despite the digs at Manilow's appearance, some praised his performances of All I Want for Christmas is You and Because It's Christmas. One ex-user shared, Barry Manilow is 80, performing live at the tree lighting in NYC. Love that. Another fan posted a snippet of his All I Want for Christmas is You performance and said, Mom's favorite artist ever is still rocking and rolling. She would have loved this. Another devoted fan wrote, Love Barry. That's why I'm a fan -alo. He represents beautiful writing and performance, still delivering at 80. Others defended him from the plastic surgery critics, with one person noting that he's as talented as he was in the 70s. On the Botox and surgery remarks, they added, It's hard enough to age without having to do it in front of the world. The tree lighting isn't Manilow's only festive event for 2023. If you want some new Christmas content, his special Special Barry Manilow's A Very, Very Christmas airs on NBC on December 11th, 2023, and hits Peacock the next day. It's a recorded version of his Vegas show, Manilow Las Vegas, The Hits Come Home. Manilow told Variety, I love doing our Christmas show. We get to sing my pop hits and my favorite Christmas songs. It's a feel-good hour full of music. TV Insider interviewed Manilow about A Very Berry Christmas, and he gave the outlet a sneak preview, saying, "...because I'm an arranger, they're not the versions you expect. I can promise they're full of joy, especially when little kids come on stage with Santa for my cornball Christmas medley." But I also stick in <laughs> Mandy and Copacabana. I know it's a Christmas show, but it doesn't matter. It always feels Christmassy. When asked why he called A Very Berry Christmas a feel-good event, Manilow replied, It's always been my job to make people feel good. When the lights go down, they forget what's going on in the world. They sing and laugh and walk out feeling better than they did. 